So right now I want to show you the difference between the CHN and the AOS operations. So to get to it, you go to second, format, and then you're going to hit the down arrow, down, down, down. There it is. And then this is where you're going to select which one it is that you want. Second. So then you're going to hit the second button. You can hit second to change it. So that's AOS. That's CHN. So let me show you what the difference is between the two. So we'll start with CHN. So right now we're in chain method. So we're going to go three plus three times two. Okay, that's 12. So now let's switch format. Let's change this from chain to AOS. So now we're going to go three plus three times two. Different number. So under the AOS method, the uh, calculator is going to use the uh, standard rules for algebra. So I'm going to put it here on the screen so you can see what the highest priority is down to the lowest priority. I'm also going to put it in the PDF file so you can look at it and be able to reference what it's going to do under the AOS uh, format versus under the chain because the chain is only going to do it as you enter it versus the AOS which is going to do it under the uh, algebraic hierarchy. So make sure you know what feature you're in, which format you're in, because it can give you dramatically different answers. And there's a good chance that the test maker will put in there the answers for both, un for both the chain and the AOS, just to see if you're using the, ch the chain or the AOS, and you'll think you got it right because you entered everything in correctly, but your calculator is actually performing the calculations differently.